channel. My name is Analia, and today we are going to be baking. It's like a baking with me. So I have no idea how to bake, actually. Well, I do know how to bake. I do know how to bake, but I don't know how to bake this. It's a rhubarb cake. It's my mom's. <laughs> It's my mom's favorite kind of cake, and I have no idea how to bake this, so I'm gonna, she's probably gonna be in the video a couple of times to show me how to bake this. But, so, I think it just starts off easy with cake batter. Before we get started, make sure you guys like, subscribe, turn your post notification bell on, and comment down below, guys. So, before we get started, I'm gonna go change into something else, or like put like a jacket over this or something, because I don't want to get messy or, you know, it's just not comfortable in this. So, I put a hoodie on, and I don't know how to start this. Mom, what do I do first? Oh, a mixing bowl so I grabbed the mixing bowl because my mom told me and then I'm going to where do I read at I poured this in there and then I put one cup of water one and a half cup of vegetable oil and three eggs okay so I'm just gonna pour the powder in there and then I'm gonna put one cup of water half a cup of vegetable oil and three eggs let's open that So I put the whole flour in there. I think I did pretty good. Besides getting it all over the rest of the counter. I'm gonna have a cup of vegetable oil. So I got the measuring cup. Do we have vegetable oil? Where's that? Okay, so I forget I'm putting things down when I'm speaking. I have my vegetable oil. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna try to put one half of a cup. I think it's one half, one half cup. Dang, no. I didn't get it on point. I thought I got it on point. Or a little bit just to get it on point. Oh shoot. Oh, this is greasy. My fingers are all greasy. So, was I even close? I think so. I passed it a little bit, I guess. No, I got it underneath. Did I? I did get it underneath. It's okay. So, <coughs> I put the oil in there. It kind of looks like egg. That's nasty. I don't know if you guys can see that. Either. Next up is three eggs. I have to put three eggs in there. Crack them in the bowl. One. Oh, I dropped a shell in there. Dang. Two. Three. Dang it. I dropped a shell in there. Okay, so. Are you sure you dumped it right? That looks like a lot of oil. Right here. It says one, two cup. And there it says one, two cup. I think I dumped it right. Are you trying to dress the maybe? You said yeah? Oh. Heat oven to 350 for shiny metal or glass pan or 325 for non-stick pan. I did not get that at all. Okay, so I'm gonna mixture it up. Um, I used this in the last video actually for my coffee thingy and that turned out pretty good. So I have a good feeling about this cake. It's gonna be bomb. It's gonna be better than my mom's. Okay, so I put this in there. <laughs> It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. <laughs> it's all over the, the floor, stove. the stove. Your hair. It's all over me. Oh, it's sticky, mom. Okay guys, so I just picked up everything, I think, and I left my hoodie on because I feel like I'm gonna get a mess again. So just in case I left my hoodie on, I did not know that was gonna happen. My mom should have prepared me before I did it. She should have told me that that was gonna happen because I would have been prepared, you know? <laughs> what, why are you laughing? I'm serious. I am. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna mix it up. I'm scared that it's gonna happen again. Look at it, why is it so clumpy? Mom, how come it's not You're like- not done. Did you put water like you were supposed to? No, they told me to put water. What's the ingredients called for? It says, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> it did tell me to put water. So what did I put in there instead of water? I swear I thought I put something in there. I don't know. Did I put water? Okay guys, so I'm pretty sure that I forgot to put water in there and it says one cup of water Yeah, it said to put one cup of water and I'm pretty sure that I didn't put any water So that's why it was so clumpy I think that's why it was so clumpy So I'm gonna start mixing it again and hopefully it doesn't go everywhere I'm gonna mix it like this first because I don't want it to go everywhere again I'm scared <laughs> Does that look good? Yeah? Did you preheat your oven? Yeah, no. 
Look at the box. Yeah. I put it to 350 or 325. Dang, mom. Okay, guys, so I'm pretty much done. My mom just told me that I needed to put the baking thing on. So that's what I read earlier and I didn't understand. This is what it looks like. I think I turned out pretty good. I'm going to be the new baker in the house, right? And shout out to my aunt, Banisha. She makes really good rhubarb cake. Okay, shout out to her. I love you. Maybe I forgot a little bit of ingredients, but I still the baker. Okay, guys, so what do I do next? Okay, so I pour it into the pan. This pan? Okay. Okay, guys, so my mom just told me I have to take a napkin and put butter on the napkin and wipe it around. Just saying, for reasons, I wash my hands before this. So I just scoop it like this. Well, that's odd. Okay, guys, so I think I did it pretty good. It was pretty satisfying. So I pour this in here now. Oh, shoot. Okay, so I try to do as much as I can. I got it all over my finger. So I put in there as much as I can. I got it all over my finger. Hopefully this cake's grow because I feel like this isn't a lot. Okay, so it's pretty much done, I guess. I just have to put it inside of the, the oven. I'm going to put it. Oh, wait, it. did you cut rhubarb up and put rhubarb in it? No. I forgot that this was a rhubarb cake. <laughs> so I have to cut rhubarb up. This is rhubarb, if you guys didn't know, because I didn't know what it was until, like, my mom first ate it before so if you guys didn't know this is called rhubarb and my mom really likes oh shoot <laughs> and my mom really likes this cake that's why i'm making it let's just push all of that to the side while we cut some rhubarb look how it looks it has little white dots in it sorry it has little tiny white dots in it it smells like nothing Okay guys, so my mom just finished cutting up all the other pieces and I don't know, this one's weird. It's like <laughs> Okay guys, look, like I was saying before we began farted, this is watermelon like color. One, but it's like watermelon kind of colored kind of thing. But anyways, let's put this in here. I don't know how to, but we're going to do it. So I put all of them in there, most of them. This is what it looks like before I have to mix it. I don't know if you guys can see that good. I don't want to tilt it all the way over. But I'm just going to mix it and try to not get the cake on the side of the pans. Like my mom just told me. I don't know how to mix this. Okay, guys. So I just added all of the rhubarb inside of them. And it looks like it's pretty good mixture and stuff. I'm going to add it inside of the oven now and let it cook for about a couple, I don't know, 20 minutes. Okay guys, so just added it in the oven and just let it cake for, I mean, just let it bake for, <laughs> just let it bake for a couple minutes, guys. Okay, so I just took the cake out. My mom was like, what did I do? Because she told me to check on the cake earlier and I stuck the fork in there and I made that big gap and she told me I was only supposed to make a gap like that, but instead I made that huge gap right there. Uh -uh. <laughs> so I'm done with the cake. I burnt it. Yeah, my mom told me I burnt um, it. Burn. It's still eatable. Um, yeah, it is. But like, this I, is how you tell it's burn. Like these are I'm hard. Eat some with a big glass of milk. Oh, this is soft. But anyways, oh yeah. Okay, guys. So the cake is like a golden kind of color, but it's not that burnt as I said. It's not like too burnt, but it's like a golden kind of color. It's just really crusty at the ends. I don't know. That's weird. So we're just setting it to cool down right now so it doesn't melt the cream. So right now we're just gonna let it sit there for a little bit and we'll get back whenever it gets cooler. Okay guys, so I think I did pretty good. Everybody likes the cake except my mom because she's mad and everything. Right? Why am I? I don't know, but she just doesn't like it. But everybody else likes it. I do like it. So I think I did pretty good. 10 out of 10 for me, even though I haven't tried it yet. So before we end this video, make sure you guys- I rated a nine. I rated a nine. See, look. Okay? No, I'm oh, not. Oh, right, Yeah. See, my mom is big mad. Okay, so before we end this video, make sure you guys like, subscribe, turn your post notification bell on, and comment down below, guys. Bye. Wait.